Okay, I'm going to set the walls up on the annex of the Telegraph X. It's fairly straightforward. The walls come in three pieces. There's a front, a rear, and of course the long wall that goes along the side. Each section of wall has a little white tag where the zipper starts. It has a number there that coincides with the zipper on the annex roof. Um, so just make sure you match up those numbers so you've got the right section of wall for the right section of annex roof. Get your zipper started from the inside there and then step around to the outside and run your zipper across standing on the outside of the annex. This will prevent the Velcro from binding while you're trying to do that zipper up. come across nice and easy. Make sure you tap that Velcro flap down to secure and waterproof that zipping area. There's a couple of little Velcro tabs on the end of each wall that go around the pole to have it sit nice. Secure the Velcro on the end of the wall closest to the camper. Then we'll get started with the long wall. Again, get that zipper started. Good idea just to hang some Velcro up there so the wall itself hangs up there, gives you the chance to use two hands to get your zipper started instead of trying to start a zipper with one hand. Once you've got that started, just like the other two walls, you want to zip that from the outside of the annex, not the inside, so that, that Velcro doesn't bind up while you're trying to do your zipper. Once you've got that long wall on, you've got a Velcro tab down the vertical side of each wall that bring those corners together. A feature of the Telegraph X Annex is the large section of wall that rolls up out of your way so you can really open that annex up. That just rolls up quite easily. There's a couple of latches up the top just to secure that off. Now you'll notice on the front of the camper, the front wall is at an angle. It's not a vertical straight up and down wall. It does sit out a bit on the footing of the base of that pole. You want the base of the pole to sit on the vinyl flap on the base of the wall. And that way when you adjust those poles up, pushing down on the base of the wall, pushing up on the annex roof, and you won't require any ropes to hold into place. As long as you've got those walls on.